Live from Jerome Harden Studios. This is the latest of my newscast. I'm willing to tell you about so as you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll tell you the latest stuff. Today is supposed to be a Walmart newscast, but I'm going to change my mind today. I'm going to talk about something else. It's going to talk about um, society today. Well, the newscast about Walmart is going to come up tomorrow or anytime this week, so keep a lookout because it's going to be awesome. So today in society um back then it was very peaceful quiet and everything seems fair the gas prices were low food prices were low no fighting well there are some fights back then but not as much as today you know but you know also um you remember the kids are just having a good time having fun playing basketball playing video games bunch of stuff I mean, most of the teenagers, 13 through 19, just want to hang out and just have a good time and stuff. But today, um, teenagers are just like, they want to have babies, want to have sex, want to drink, smoke, anything. I mean, this is crazy for real. I mean, now they're on Facebook, even the girls. I mean, young as um, 11 years old, um, they're trying to get with older men, lie about their age, talking about they're 19, 21, 22 years old. Really, they're just 11, 12, and 13 years old. Um, they trying to be um, a bunch of little sluts and thoughts. Um, really, that's true. I mean, there are a lot of teenagers out there who just want to do adult stuff, and then the girls get pregnant, and then the guys leave the girls to trying to take care of the babies on their own, which is not right because it wasn't that much deadbeats today. It was a lot of deadbeats today. Sorry about that sentence, but truth is, truth is, um, there was a lot of deadbeats around this world today, unfortunately. Um, but there are a lot of men that stepped up to take care of the babies and stuff. Even the boys that are 13 or older, some of them are just still take care of the babies, try their best, and despite their dreams and schoolwork and stuff. But I'm just salute them. But you know. And all back to the girls, um, society on social media, um, they just posted pictures of themselves naked, half naked, and trying to be sexy for all the boys and stuff. And you know, since the news media warned the parents about that stuff, um, sometimes they can go in their child's account and look at all the stuff they've been doing, and sometimes the results can get um, unpleasant and unfriendly. Just like um, this result right here when this girl was being talking about she was being a fight and here's the result when her mom found out about this. Well, it wasn't fun to watch, was it? People got to be careful because, you know, if they have the brains, they can just um, go in there and just lock their computer down or lock their account up for uh, certain people to see and not everybody. So nobody can't see it, including their parents, because you have to be really, really smart to hide your stuff. Because if you don't, the parents will find out. But, yeah. I was a kid once, I used to do a lot of sneaky stuff, so, so learn from experience and just don't get caught, that's all I had to say. And a lot of riots around this world today, just like black people getting killed by police, but it wasn't true. It wasn't that no reason that uh, 
black people are getting killed by police. It was just because they committed crimes and stuff. And uh, all the black community are trying to defend that uh, that person got shot for no reason. Well, that person must have did something to, for them to show, shoot them. Just like uh, this one incident here in Huntsville where a man got, got shot because he was stabbed, he was lunging at police with a knife. So, there was no reason for him to just blame the police for that. Because all the police were doing, they, they were just doing their job. Seriously. I mean, there's no reason for him to protest like that. So, good thing there's not a protest today. Because if, if, it, if it is, then I don't know what I'm, what I'm going to do. So, and anyway, so... All I had to say is that um, there are just riots and more riots every day because one certain person got killed for just no reason, which there is always a reason that everything happens. Yeah, so sometimes uh, argument on Facebook can lead to deadly fights, um, get their ass beat, or even getting fired from your job because... Companies are now getting bigger and bigger about Facebook now. You just have to be careful on what you post. Because the companies are not playing about that. You just have to hide your stuff real good. Just like I just said. Because just like I just said about the teenagers um, doing uh, dirty stuff on the social media network. So older men can find out. And they can look at their bodies and stuff. And just talk to them sexy and stuff. Well, same thing for an adult here. If you're trying to keep a job, you have to be really careful what you're doing. Cause even on social media, if you even if you're not at work, just don't um, just don't post any bad stuff about the company you're working for. Uh, putting your work clothes on, taking a selfie, or taking a selfie like that while at work when you're not supposed to. Cause what happens is you get fired for that, or you can get in trouble for that. So. Just be careful on that stuff, and then you'll be good. Cause I'm trying to look out for y'all. Okay. Well, tomorrow on this special newscast about Walmart, almost got it ready. Just have one piece left to do, and then I have to get everything together, and then it's gonna be a blast. So, just keep a lookout, and I'll see y'all tomorrow. But until next time, I'm J Dog. I'm out. Peace.